are these people? Uh, all right. So, um, yeah, we're, we're going to pull out just some, some weird, I mean, it, it, usually if I pull out covers, they're, uh, they're a little off the beaten path. Um, I'm admittedly not a huge uh, Tracy Chapman fan, but her version of A Holy Night is fucking phenomenal. It's so good. Um, when I lived in the Keys, I did uh, a local radio thing um, where they wanted a few Christmas songs, and I uh, I did this. And it's funny, like, I... Uh, not... Uh, not Christian by um, any stretch of the imagination, but uh, growing up, I always loved Christmas. And that's like one of the few holidays that still, especially now that I, I have a kid, like, um, I know just the, the nostalgia factor for me is a, uh, is a biggie. And I'm also a big Christmas music snob because for me, it's like, there's the classics and why cover them for the most part. Mm -hmm. Uh so it's like you've got your original, you know, like your your Dean Martin, Bing Crosby kind of those. Like that's, I don't need beyond that, with the exception of like a handful of songs. And this is one. This was one of the instances where I'll like, I will totally take this uh, over over an original. Even though I feel like a, um, I don't know, a, a little bit of an imposter playing a. Uh, playing Christmas music. Uh, <laughs> Merry Christmas, everyone. Jesus. Oh, that's beautiful. 